And you may have heard that roar in the background. That was because the crowd caught sight of Fernando Torres about to come on. We've seen a lot of uh, Liverpool legends of old tonight with the uh, great Bill Shankly team from the 60s and 70s. But in Torres, we have a modern-day hero who, in the eyes of the Liverpool fans, would stand alongside any one of them. And here he comes, 10 goals in 11 Premier League games this season. Well, he looks a bit disappointed, David Ngog. He's put in a very good shift and, of course, got the goal. He is, he is the difference between the sides. He has done it very well, Ngog. He's got a good goal, but he is a legend. And he's making his 100th appearance for Liverpool tonight. Torres, the new threat for the Wigan defence. You're right there, he's got a fantastic record. 34 goals in 36 league games here. Mascherano, lovely ball. Gerard, Torres in space. Brushed aside by Melchior, but I think the referee was right to say get on with it. Yeah, legitimately so. Decent defending by Melchior. Because Torres peeled his run and just got in between the fullback and the centre half. Mouth just, just shepherds him out of it. Decent defending from the Dutch, Dutchman. A real landslide. But they've battened up the hatches a little bit, but I think it's been more Liverpool's poor finishing. And Wigan are very much still in this game here, but that's a foul, that's a free kick. Liverpool was back defending. Making it two or three in, he's helping his teammates out. That's why he's such a good team player. He's fresh, come off the bench, and he's proven a point. Mascherano with a quick throw to Lucas. Gerard. Oh, Torres and uh, Ago are waiting to pounce. Here is Torres. Away by Bramble. And Carragher's got to clear that. Oh, Diego is really closing him down. And now it's broken to Torres. Is this his moment? No! It might be yet! And it's scrambling in the end! Liverpool double their lead! Not the cleanest goal he'll ever score, but it's another one to add to the catalogue. Well, the legends of yesteryear are in the stand, and a legend on the pitch does his business. The only surprising aspect is sloppy from Wigan defensively. The only surprise he shows real composure there and the surprise is he doesn't finish first time. But if at first you don't succeed, try again and eventually he scrambles it into the net. Great skill there to get past Kirkland and then he goes for the flick with the outside of the boot but it still has the peace of mind to get around Bramble and put it into the empty net. I called it, Alan, I said this legend. He'd have enough time to score and he duly obliges and he puts Liverpool 2 near ahead and out of sight it's really good attacking by Torres and really good composure and Bramble will feel a little unfortunate because he gets back well defensively but Torres has the composure to put it into the empty net and he keeps up his remarkable scoring record at Anfield, 35 goals in 37 league games on this ground. Incredible. Well, that was an important challenge, but Liverpool could still break here. And Aquilani on the ball to Torres. You just expect something when he's in possession. In Sewer. A few themselves, the best for Scotland. Torres, Aquilani, if the old pass goes astray, here's Kaut, oh, well played uh, Kaut, Torres with the cross, Aquilani was waiting to come in, Lucas behind him, and it's Aquilani, oh, and not from Figueroa, that could be costly, Mascherano, Torres in a great position, he's kicked him out, and usually for Torres his first touch wasn't the best, 
Still made something out of it, though. Here he is again. That was a handball, wasn't it? Oh, I must say, I thought everyone in the ground saw that, apart from Mr. Dow. <laughs> I think it's a nervous ending, but it would be ca catastrophe if Wigan managed to get an equaliser for Liverpool. And he's now, by the way, one goal away from breaking the Liverpool club record for the fastest player to reach 50 league goals.